cloud definition its advantage and disadvantage now cloud cloud uh, computing from the cloud computing cloud is elaborated as common location independent online utility available on demand that means it's a common services available for the all location independent independent that is it is not based on any location it's available online it's a utility or a kind of the services okay utility like uh, uh, our uh, electricity or you can say telephone it's a, like a utility available on demand as per our demand it is available so that one is a cloud cloud computing and these are the different uh, definition of the cloud computing first one is a cloud computing collects all the computing resources all the computing resources means different kind of the resources it's like a software even hardware and uh, um, 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 any another applications storage capacity means all the kind of the resources and that means they collect the all the kind of resources and manage them automatically through the software means everything is managed automatically cloud computing another definition is cloud computing is emerging style of computing where where application this application data and resources are provided to the user on a web that means they provide the application data and resources uh, to the user on the web cloud and the another definition is cloud computing is a service where storage and computing resources can be accessed on the subscription basis that means what they want to say that it is a service where storage and the other computing resources are available to the user on based on their subscription so based on the subscription everything is available to the user on the online now these are the advantage of the cloud computing first one is a reduced cost actually if you want to build a infrastructure of the cloud computing at that time it takes a lot of effort lot of time and lot of investment investment although they claim that cloud computing reduce the cost but how it will reduce the cost so first one is uh, this one. because cloud provides us a paper use that means we based on paper use means based on your usage you are paying that one is a paper use means based on your utility based on your usage that means if you have a heavily usage you have to pay more and if you are using less then you have to pay uh, pay less for that particular thing so hence need to pay for the services which which you have used and second let's say the uh, uh, cloud provides supports the or provides a lot of resources and different kind of the services but you have to few you have to pay for those services which you have sus uh, for which you have subscribed so in that sense uh, at the user and they will reduce the cost second to uh, for a business startup there is no need to establish any infrastructure uh, new uh, people who want to start their uh, uh, business they can go for the cloud computing uh, infrastructure they can hire the services uh, based on their requirement so there is no need uh, need to pay for any maintenance cost even so in that sense it will reduce the cost they increase the storage that means uh, cloud the cloud claim that uh, cloud is elastic elastic means what is the property of the elastic that means when you it is stretchable that means you can stretch it and suppose if you um, drop then it will again Uh, comes in its original uh, size so that one is elastic so in that sense they want to say that uh, as per your requirement you can increase the capacity suppose you want more storage more uh, more processing so at that time you can uh, uh, take it from the cloud because they provides the illusion of infinite resources that means they are saying that infinite resources are available to the user so in that sense they increase the resources a uh, storage capacity flexibility change based on your uh, changing business needs or based on your requirement you can um, easily add the services and if you does not need require then you can easily remove the services so in that 
since it is a flexible now second one is a uh, uh, what is another advantage of the cloud that it improve the performance cloud uh, what they say is that how uh, means they say that cloud computing improve the performance that means uh, cloud computing uh, generally whatever the Uh, uh, computers in a cloud are available they have a latest version availability that means their software are updated generally they boot boots faster and their processing speed is high so in that sense they improve the performance second one is a universal access to document that means as the cloud is available over the internet what we say that cloud is available over the internet so universal access to the document as it's online as a cloud cloud is where it's online so you can access your document from any location that one is a universal access to document now the disadvantage constant the first disadvantage is that constant internet connection is required uh, that means suppose you want to use the cloud services so then you need the internet connection and uh, you need a high speed inter second disadvantage is that you need a high speed internet connection that means cloud computing services does not work well with the low speed internet connection that means you need a high speed internet connection vendor lock in this one is the biggest disadvantage of the cloud computing that means uh, what is the vendor locking that means user is locked with only one vendor that one is a vendor locking uh, for example uh, let's say suppose we are we have a mobile sim card and uh, easily you are moving from one company mobile service provider to the mobile sim provider to another sim provider uh, then there is no vendor locking that means you are not locked with only one vendor as per your choice you can move with the another vendor so here in case of the in case of the cloud computing you are locked with the with only one vendor and suppose if you want to move with the another vendor and if you if you if you think that the some another vendor provides a good services then at that time uh, it is not easy for us that uh, moving from one vendor to another vendor is uh, not easy or it is not with uh, without a substantial cost or there is some legal action so that one is a vendor lock in period data may not be secure uh, because uh, what cloud computing claims that they provide a zero downtime and uh, uh, fast access uh, uh, recovery from the failure so to do all these things generally they replicate replicate so you can say duplicate the information at different location and uh, let's say we have uh, um, uh, stored our uh, personal information our albums on a cloud computing then actually we are not knowing where our these information where where our files are stored in a cloud cloud at which at which location they are stored who are handling them we are not knowing that one and uh, there may be a security leakage problem in case of the cloud computing so this one is a disadvantage of cloud computing thank you for watching my video in the next video we will see the uh, types of the cloud computing thank you